Bills, and it's going to be interesting. And it's going to be interesting to see who has the upper hand early. It's going to be difficult to find out how this plays out, right? Striker versus well-rounded fighter. Who's going to be the one that's going to control where this fight takes place? Oh, nice job to land the straight punch there. Must be nice to have that kind of reach advantage, DC. I know you can't necessarily relate. Head kick there, blocked by Lee. Oh, man, head kick land. Changes his stance. Whoa! What a fantastic strike to throw at the exact right moment. He deserves this moment. Go finish this fight. And he connects with a punch there. We'll see if he can follow it up. He landed that punch over and over again. What's he going to do to follow up? He's got to be careful dipping his head when he's throwing that jab. Well, defense doesn't necessarily win championships in MMA, but he's doing a nice job blocking these shots. He's not allowing his opponent to get any damage off on him by blocking all these attacks. Look at the turnover in that kick. Back and forth we go. Throwing that jab yet again out of range. Connects with a right. Very tricky when he throws that body kick. And just misses with that big right hand. Lee gets caught with that punch. He's throwing every part of himself into these big leg kicks. Oh, significant strike attempt there, but a huge block. Big kick lands. Oh, nice combination of kicks there by Lee. Miss with that jab attempt there. And he landed the right hand there. Flush. Oh, blocks that kick to the body. Nicely done. Lee gets caught with that punch. Not the easiest guy in the world to hit, but he got caught there. accuracy on that kick. No wind up, no tell, just a brutal kick. Well, he continues to stay busy. What do they say, DC? Punches in bunches? Punches and bunches. He's landing them upside his opponent's head over and over again. Very nice leg kick there by Lee. Well, he's got the reach advantage. You might as well use it. Nice job there to find a home for that job. Over and over, he's landing these big body kicks. Back and forth we go. Look at how he turns his hip into that leg kick. There it is. Take a shot now. Take a shot. Lee going for the head kick. No dice. What a punch. Look at him drive his shin into his opponent's body with that body kick. Just misses. Lands and maybe time to get the bonus checks ready. I mean, this fight is about done. He's got to hurt very bad with his head kick. Now he has to find one more strike to end the night. Yeah, he's mixed it all up. That is a huge shot right there, DC. You don't want to eat too many more of those. No, and he needs to start looking to finish now because he's got his opponent hurt very bad. Just misses with that one. I mean, he's cutting down the size with these beautiful leg kicks. Big kick lands. Oh, 
All right, so there is the horn at times in that previous round. I didn't think we'd get here after that head kick nearly had him out of there. It was a good round leading up to that. But when you take a head kick like that, when your opponent gets your entire body into that kick, usually the night's over. Very tough to still be standing, but he can't take many more like that. over when he throws that kick. Oh, he lands another strike to the body, really starting to connect on a lot of shots to the midsection, and these will take their toll as this fight goes into the latter rounds. Right under the elbow, the body keeps landing. Lee gets caught with that punch. Ooh, head kick lands, he's hurt. Just out of range for that strike. Well, we told you off the top he had the reach advantage, and you saw it right there with that punch. All right, so he's landed some good shots. You hate to be overly critical, but nothing really in terms of combinations tonight. Well, the jab has been looking great. How about jab, jab, right hand? Right. Because eventually you're going to have to put something on your opponent that's going to really make him pause. I believe the jab has been working so well, if he drops a big right hand after it, he may be able to finish his fight. He has a commitment to kicking tonight, and it shows. Timely defense there, huge block for him. Ooh, nice slip there to avoid the punch by Lee. Look at him chopping the wood. Chop the wood with those leg kicks. Oh, continuing to work the body to great effect. Real sneaky head kick gets in there. Big power punch land. Now he gets back to range. Right under the elbow. Goes to the body there. Right hand landed. Just missed on the overhand left. Good head movement there. Well, he's really starting to land a high number of strikes here in the second round. No denying that he has taken the message from his corner and picked up the pace here in round two. Nice strike. He's able to slip the leg. Nice head kick. Oh, and he caught the kick. Real nice body kick land. Much improved defensively as he blocks the shot. Oh, he's got that right hand going tonight, DC. Connected with it there. He's thrown so many left jabs to throw that right punch straight down the pipe. It's unreal. Oh! Huge kick to the head. Defense. Trying to kick the leg out. Oh, that's a beautiful kick right there. I don't know if you've ever been kicked by a mule. It'll probably feel something like that. It has to. This guy has landed this kick with so much force. Big leg kick lands. Nice. Oh, nice job to block the kick. Straight right is there. There's no kill on that leg. Some nice back and forth action here. All right, so he continues to use his jab effectively here, DC. He gets that hand to the target pretty quick. I mean, just right away, blasting the jab after jab after jab. He's a phenomenal boxer with a vast understanding of fighting behind that educated jab. 
Oh, and he connects there. His hands look good to him. So fast. I mean, this guy has tremendous hand speed. Oh, there's that front kick. That was nasty. That front kick really does affect the breathing pattern of your opponent. There's no tell on that leg kick. Tries the flying knee to no avail. Watch knees to the body. Look at him whip his hips into that kick. Well, his kicking game was outstanding in that round of adjustments, but take us through the replays before we get there. It's always weird to watch a young fighter start to come into his own. Early in his career, he did not have this ability. He did not have the ability to dictate and control fights with his legs. Now he does, and he looks like a future champion in the making. All right, so after he landed a high number of kicks in the previous round, we'll see if he can keep it going here as our next round gets in. He should stay the course. He's so educated with his legs and his feet that he's given his opponent a very difficult time trying to anticipate what's coming his way. Well, most fighters can't keep up this type of aggression and pace, but you don't have to worry about this guy. He hasn't really showed any signs of slowing down tonight. Big punch lands over the top. How's he gonna follow this one up? Oh, nice job with the knee strike there. That'll wake you up. He thought it would be available. He just knew he had to find the right time to throw it. That was the right time. Trying to land the elbow there to no avail. Sound defensively blocks the shot. Went for the inside leg kick. Splits the guard, lands the right hand. Just misses with the punch by Lee. Look at the force behind that leg kick. Oh, nice job to slip off the center line there. His head movement has been a huge, huge factor defensively in this fight. You can never be a stationary target, so even if the feet aren't moving, you gotta be ready to slip that head at a moment's notice. How good is that right hand? And he continues to work the body here. Big kick lands. Went for the inside leg kick. Nice, sneaky head kick. Oh! He's in trouble. He's hurt bad. Well, not a guy you want on top of you. Ground and pound strikes piling up here. Good work by Lee. Came of inches right there, oh, boy. Wow. It was a good night if that landed. Oh! Lee gets hit by that leg kick. Out of range with that one. All right, so a nice shot there defensively to raise the guard and prevent any damage. Those hands never leave where they're supposed to be. And if you do that, most times you will block the shot that's incoming. Well, it's all pace and pressure down the stretch. He is really lighting them up now. Nice loop and punch. Lands an outside leg kick of his own. Oh, and he is getting tagged repeatedly. Nice combination of strikes up top. Oh, beautiful combination up top. I don't understand why the guy is not moving his head. Get your head moving, son. Oh, massive knee to the body. That can't feel good. Big leg kick land. Well, the body work starting to take its toll. Look at the redness starting to appear on his left side. So they continue to exchange. And just inches away from landing one of those big right hands. Well, he's doing a nice job here blocking these shots. The chin is tucked, the hands are high. Pretty good job. 
up thus far. How's his opponent still standing? I mean, I have no idea. This fight is supposed to be over. And it might not be over now, but it's gonna be over very soon. Nice punch there by Lee. He went high on that one. Whoa! Oh, he's hurt bad. He's hurt bad, John. He's gotta press him. He's gotta go chase that finish down now. There, huge block. Man, looks like he's trying to set records here, landing all of these strikes. He is aggressive to a fault and really has been all night long as he continues to pour it on. Got to be careful. Oh, what a job to get the head kick home, and now his opponent in a world of trouble. Such a sneaky head kick. He did not recognize him. Well, there are a few things more fun to watch in mixed martial arts. The entertaining scrap so far. Watching big round four in there, maybe even a 10-8. There was a big knockdown in there, courtesy of the kick. DC talk us through it. He found his spot. I mean, he knew that there was a weakness. He found the spot. He recognized an opportunity to go and chase down that head kick. He threw it, it landed, and he almost got the finish. All right, next round is underway, and if you look at these two guys in between rounds, it looks like they've barely broken a sweat, both with good resting heart rate, stamina still very high, and you just have to laud the efforts of these guys in training. Both men certainly noted cardio specialists, but incredible that they would have this much in the tank after 10-plus minutes of fighting. Well, just as he did in the previous round, he continues to connect on a high volume of strikes. And a good sign, too, doesn't seem to be slowing down Whoa! whatsoever. Oh, big knee! Dude's hurt. Serve him up. Go get him. Lees has got full mount now. All right, he's trying to control posture here. Now trying to hip escape. He's just trying to move out of this position off the bottom. Strong bottom work here, staying busy. Oh, his opponent squirming like a fish out of water now. The ground and pound is on point. This could very well be the beginning of the end. This could be the beginning of the end. We've seen some really good ground and pound fighters. This young man is as good as any we've ever seen. Whiffs on that offering. Left hook coming, it's blocked. Look at the whip action that comes from him throwing that kick. Oh! Huge right hand! He needs to start looking to finish now because he's got his opponent hurt very bad. Oh, straight right! That was a thudding leg kick. Man, the body work continues to be a factor here. Look at the size of that bruise on his body. Lee gets caught with that punch. Trying to establish that jab once again. Nice head kick. Sound defense there as he blocks the shot. If you take more of these leg kicks, you will not be able to be very active on your feet. Nice punch land over the top. Oh. He's out! Holy smoke! What a performance! Yeah, that right there is a high-level knockout, ladies and gentlemen. Crowd absolutely loving it. Just a perfect shot to end the fight. Landed flush. I'm not even sure his opponent saw it coming. So a huge, huge win for that young fighter here tonight. Oh, we'll take a look back at the highlights. You know we're gonna find that nasty head kick somewhere in this highlight rip. Just an incredible result for him. A very nice head kick to finish the fight, but don't ignore all the work he did with his hands and give credit to the opponent. The opponent was in there every step of the way, and in order to get a fight of the night like he got tonight, both guys have to be willing to participate.
Ladies and gentlemen, referee Eve Leving has called a stop to this contest at two minutes, 34 seconds of round number four. Declaring the winner by knockout, Bruce the Dragon.